In this procedure, we will be streaking on blood auger plates, also called BAP. Using a sharpie, divide the plate in half. We will attempt to streak for isolation using only half of the plate. Diagrams of this procedure are provided in your lab manual. There is also another difference in this procedure. After streaking one of your quadrants, do not flame your loop. Instead, stab the loop through an unstreaked portion of the auger. Now you can flame your loop. This lets us detect the presence of streptolysin O, which is inactivated in the presence of oxygen. Do the same thing to the other half of the plate. Invert the plate and place it in the incubation bucket on the side bench.